let's go and do a speed comparison between them. And the OnePlus 8T has that Qualcomm Snapdragon 865 chipset, an octa-core CPU, an Adreno 650 GPU, and 8 gigs of RAM on that base model, and 12 gigs of RAM on that top tier model, where the iPhone 11 has that Apple A13 Bionic chip, X-core CPU, and 4 gigabytes of RAM on all the models. So let's go and see which one is the faster phone between these two. Okay, now that we're back, let me go and clear out all the apps on this device and the OnePlus 8T. All the apps are cleared out on here as well. So let's start loading these things up. Let's go and do their phone calls, 3, 2, 1. About the same on both. Swiping out of these, they both feel kind of the same amount of smoothness right there. We can do their app stores, 3, 2, 1. And the OnePlus 8T definitely was a little bit faster there. The iPhone 11 was a little bit slower, but not a big deal. Smoothness wise, I mean, I'll definitely tell you the 120 hertz on the OnePlus 8T looks very smooth, but it just kind of looks like the OnePlus 8T is a little bit more stutterier, I guess, when you go ahead and swipe out or do anything on it. Now I have, as always, a lot of these third party apps that we can go and get into. So we can go and do like Temple Run 2, for example. 3, 2, 1. And you can see the OnePlus 8T kind of looked a little bit faster to me, guys. I don't know if it was for you, but it's definitely noticeably faster. We're already loaded on the OnePlus 8T. iPhone 11, a little bit delay, but not a big deal at all. Getting to some speed comparison, I guess. It's a very basic game. You're not going to be able to notice that big of a difference. Let's go and swipe out of this one. Let's do the next one. Snake versus Blocks, 3, 2, 1. And you can see the OnePlus 8T again was the faster one getting into some gameplay. We'll probably be able to see that it's going to be about the same. I think the OnePlus 8T kind of stuttered a little bit there right in the beginning with. It could have just been me, but I mean, in terms of gameplay for that one, it's a very basic game as well. Now we can try Fruit Ninja, but I've been running into a lot of issues on the AT321. It kind of opens and then it kind of closes, as you can see. I'm not too sure why that happens. That exact same thing happened on my Pixel 5 as well. So it's a very weird thing. I honestly don't know how to explain it. We can do stack, three, two, one. And you can see that I think the OnePlus 8T was a little bit faster, but to get into the ad, it was faster on the iPhone 11. So I'm not really entirely sure which one I would pick in that case. Let's go and do Snapchat, three, two, one. I guess the OnePlus 8T was faster, but I was already logged into here. So I don't know which one to say that about that one. We can do Twitter, three, two, one. And again, actually they both were pretty close. I'm not really too sure which one was the faster one there. We can go into Paper IO 2, which I don't even think I have. We can just do Netflix, 3, 2, 1. One plus AT faster, followed by the iPhone 11. And we can go and do Thank You, 3, 2, 1. And OnePlus 8T again is a faster one, iPhone 11 a little bit behind, but you know, definitely when you're going day by day, are you going to notice these big of a differences? Probably not, unless you're comparing them side by side like I am every single day. Let's go and do Upofa, 3, 2, 1. And the OnePlus 8T, I guess, was slightly faster. The iPhone 11, a little bit behind. Again, not a ginormous deal. We can go and do Quizlet, 3, 2, 1. Both almost identically the same on both. We can do Real Racing 3, 3, 2, 1. And this may take a minute on the iPhone. Sometimes it does take a little bit longer on iPhones for some reason. I don't know if this game is not optimized for that device or something. As you can see, the OnePlus 8T fully loaded. The iPhone 11 it's probably going to take its time a little bit. And I don't know, again, if this is exactly the best ending off comparison. I've seen time and time again, you know, this device, not even just iPhone 11, but just a game takes a long time. So I don't really know what to say about it. <laughs> As you can see, we're eventually into it on the iPhone 11 right there. So I don't really know which one I would say is the faster one. I, I, I would, if I had to say it, I'd probably end up saying maybe the iPhone 11 is just a little bit slower than the OnePlus 8T as a whole. I think both devices are still very, very capable, obviously. And I don't think one, like if you have an iPhone 11 or you have a OnePlus 8T, I don't think you should go from one device to the other just based off the performance. I feel like you're going to get similar performances for the most part, but I think the OnePlus 8T may be just be a little bit faster more times than not. But still, it was very, very close between both. And, you know, I, I'll give it to the OnePlus 8T. It's a very fast device, but I still think the iPhone 11 for being a year old at this point is still pretty capable for sure so and the fact that it's even somewhat comparable to this type of device is really impressive so that really pretty much covers it up there